So we are so lucky this afternoon. We've got Professor Cox here to help us to do an investigation. Hello. Hello. The great thing is science is the study of everything in nature. You can study anything you want, so including the things that you love the most. So what's the thing you love the most, do you think? Chocolate! <laughs> it's got to be chocolate, hasn't it? So we need to find out today the time it takes for different types of chocolate to melt. Oh, are, you yeah. a, are you a chocolate fan? I, I'm a massive chocolate fan. And if it was up to me, I'd just eat it all. <laughs> it's a scientific experiment, though. That's the thing. So we can't eat our experiments, can we? OK, so you've all got the equipment that you need on your tables. So we're ready to start the investigation. You know how to do your fair test. Make sure you remember to record your results. Off we go. <laughs> So I'm going to give you three pieces of chocolate, one dark, this is a dark one, got the milk one, and we've got the white one. There we go. Three, two, one, go. Which one seems to be melting the quickest initially? Dark. I think this one. This one. It does, doesn't it? Oh, my. I forgot to time this going. Oh, you forgot to press the timer, did you? OK, so what problem is that going to pose for the investigation if we've got... It won't George... be a fair test. That's right, we, you won't get the right result, will you? Because your timer will have started after George's and Sophia's. Yeah. So what do you think we should do? I think we should start again. Start again. Yeah. Start afresh. Start afresh. Not a problem. Mm -hmm. Mine's done. Oh, yours was done quite a while ago. What? Yours was done quite a while ago, oh. Matt. There's some water in my truck. Oh, gosh. So how do you think the water got into the foil tray? Might be when I was stirring. I didn't notice, but I pressed it a bit too much while I was looking at my stopwatch. OK. So how is that going to affect your investigation? It'll melt quicker and then it'll become more of a liquid. Yeah. Won't make it a fair test. It won't make it a fair test, will it? Might have to start again. OK. No problem. OK, then, so let's look at your results. So, girls, let's go with you first of all. Which chocolate melted the quickest? Uh, the dark, dark chocolate. The dark chocolate melted the fastest. Boys, which chocolate melted the quickest for you? The white chocolate. Oh, so that's interesting. Why do you think the different groups got different results? How did you decide when to stop your stopwatch? There's no lumps in there. So, do you think your view of when it had melted would be the same as someone else's view of when it's melted. Um, no. Not all the time. Not all the time. So that could account for the differences in your results. Yeah. 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 Maybe. Could be, yeah, possibly. So what were you asking them to do when they've got the results? OK, so I would ask them to say, have a look at the results, say what they've found out from the results, and then try and draw some conclusions, and then we'd probably plot the results on a graph. Yeah. 